Lungile took it and I told him not to. But he was so angry that Vanessa wouldn't hire him. So you swear to me you had nothing to do with it? I swear. Oh, yeah, I believe you. You're going to tell Danny? I was thinking the police will call them and explain that your brother took it and... No, no way. He stole Tarbo and from our neighbor. When I was young, my mother left. And our father wasn't around. So me and Lungile, we only had each other. He's all the family I have. OK. Let's go and talk to him. Thank you. Blood results are back. In record time. Raised acidity levels. You'll need to perform an endoscopy. Are you thinking ulcers? Must have developed because of the malnutrition. No wonder she didn't feel like eating. Well, at least she's in the right place then. Danny Trevanion. Yes. Yeah. All right, go ahead. Are you sure? Thank you. Who was that? Matthew. Says he knows who the illegal animal shipment was intended for. Oh, that's good. It's complicated. The animals were headed for Mara. Not here. No idea where he is. No. But I did find something else. Oh. What am I going to do? If the police come asking questions and find it, I go straight back to jail. Don't panic. We'll work out something. We need to get rid of it. We'll dump it or burn it. I don't care. Yeah, OK. Look, the way I see it, we only got one choice. To be honest with you, it's not the most sensible idea I've ever had, and that's saying something. Come on, let's go. Tarbo's not answering his phone. I don't think they're coming. Can we start, please? Might as well. There's an epic amount of Greek salad to eat. Perhaps they're with two. It's not like him to miss a meal. Well, if they're not joining us, then you're all out of excuses. I know you, Danny Trevanian. And you're avoiding going to Mara because you hate confrontation. I'm not avoiding anything. Yes, you are. Look, just go and talk to Vanessa. I'm sure there's a reasonable explanation for what she did. Save me some. Somehow I don't think that'll be a problem. You didn't have to come, do I wasn't going to let you get bloody caught and take the blame for this. Of course I had to come. Besides, it's part of what makes me cool. Yeah, I mean, I left the car. I was... Oh, uh, I didn't realise you were busy. It's fine, Daddy. We were just finishing up. Sorry to hear about your car. Thanks. Are you the neighbour, Mr... Trevanian? That's me. Good. You've saved me a trip. I understand you have a certain Mr. Tabo Ngone working for you. He's a parolee. Oh, I know Tabo. He didn't steal that car, he just wouldn't. So you can vouch for his whereabouts? I can vouch for him. He didn't do it. If you say so. Do you mind if I take a quick look around, talk to some of the staff? Be my guest. What a day it's been. It's nice to see a friendly face. You fancy a drink? Your day's not about to get any better. You know I'm state vet now. Of course. Yeah, congratulations. This morning I was called out to a plane full of animals being illegally smuggled into the country and sold on. To you. What? You know this man. 
Yeah, I arranged to buy some animals from him. But I swear, I, I had no idea that it wasn't above board. Really? Danny. <laughs> he had a website. Um, he had a business card. Look, I can show you, if you like. So you're telling me that you paid full price? Then you must have known it wasn't legitimate. You just chose to look the other way. I was stupid. It won't happen again, I promise. I have to write a report. And depending on my recommendations, there may be sanctions. Sanctions? A fine. I'm trying to stamp out this kind of smuggling. I understand that. But you know me. Oh, Danny, we've been friends a long time now. You know I wouldn't do this deliberately. Please, don't report me. Next time, call me. Thank you. Right. I think we'd better put the lights off, eh? We'll get it as near to the gate as we can. Maybe they'll just think it was kids taking it for a joyride, you know? What? A car. <laughs> Okay. Check behind the seat, see if we left anything behind. Doop. Hmm? Oh, no. Control, this is Papa Sierra 260. Over. Go ahead, 260. Reporting affirmative ID on suspected 108501. On, Over. Wait. Ah, Trevanian, I didn't see you there. Where were you last night? Uh, at Fatani's, and a couple of beers, you know? What about Tarbo? You joined me. Not for the beers, just for the company. Oh, I was at Fatani's all evening, babysitting. Why didn't you look me up and come and say hello? Well, we got talking. Tarbo can really chat, you know. You forgot about dinner. It's Greek salad, I had. My fault, I completely lost track of time. Yes, you must have. I tried waiting up for you, but I was fast asleep by the time you came back. Danny, the cheetah's in trouble. What's going on, Anders? You seem shifty. Nothing. I just need more coffee, that's all. I've been looking everywhere. Where you been? Working for a living, like normal people do. And where's the car? Dup found it. You went around and I couldn't get caught with it. So we took it back tomorrow. You idiot! I spoke to the guys on the phone I owed money to last night. I told them I had a car. What are you talking about? I needed the money, OK? So I told them I'd give them the car as payment. But now, well, well look, they're the kind of people who are not happy to wait. Well, I had no idea. Why, why didn't you tell me? Now where are you going? They're looking for me now. And trust me, you don't want them coming here. Breathing's right down. Blood pressure's low. Liver and kidney functions both affected. It's gastronephritis syndrome. What's happening to her? Well, she's been hungry for a long time. 
So her body started breaking down its own fat to stay alive. Is that bad? It can be. I'm going to start her on IV antibiotics and parental nutrition, if it's not too late. Danny? Danny? Where are you going? Mara. Why? I took the state job to make a difference, and the first chance I got, I backed down. You didn't back down? Of course I did. I let Vanessa off the hook because we were friends, but no one should get special treatment. Look, Vanessa said that she didn't know. She was buying animals at cut price rates, Alice. She knew it wasn't right. She looked the other way. That's what keeps this trade going. We can save the world in two days. Danny! Run you left. Where did you go? Are you okay? I'm fine. I told them I didn't have the car. They didn't take it too well. I can help you get the money. I can sell whatever I've got. You're calling favors. I can talk to Danny. He'll find a way to work something out. You really think that guy is going to help a thief like me? He helped me. We are not like them, T. You're wasting time thinking you're ever going to be anything but a charity case. You're not one of them. 